no, nah, I don't like seeing Meg back at all. Not, not as a bowler. She's just so hard to bowl to. Um, she hits the ball so cleanly and she's so powerful. Takes full toll of it. Another boundary in this over for her. Ah, uh, Meg. If you don't get her early, you're not going to get her out. It's been great having her not play domestic cricket for the last couple of years, if I'm honest. Harman Pritkor thinks she's got a chance. She doesn't have a chance. About six rows back has a chance. It's going to be great, but it's not going to be great bowling to her. Oh. Well, Lanning goes. She goes big. She goes long, and it doesn't take her long to get her innings well underway. I got an opportunity to, to go and play with Perth. The timing of the opportunity came up. It was a difficult period for me, I guess. With, I just sort of had my shoulder operation and knew I wasn't going to be playing. And um, yeah, it was a bit of a, a tricky time, but um, yeah, they sort of came through with an offer and uh, saw it as a good opportunity to develop and I guess join another team and work with different individuals and coaches. Um, yeah, just looking forward to, to getting over there and um, you know playing and, and being a part of it this year. Yeah, last year was, was a bit weird to be honest. I was I was around the, the squad for a little bit of it, but watching it was pretty difficult. I didn't enjoy that too much. It's a very easy game from the sidelines. You probably see things from a different perspective, but when you're actually in it and out there, it's, it's not as clear and not as easy. So even though I hated it, just watching it from a different perspective, I think has, has helped me come back and, and deal in a different situation.